All right. Everyone is talking about the sweltering heat in New Mexico. We told you yesterday how health experts say it's so important that you stay hydrated and cool to avoid heat exhaustion and stroke. And we've had a number of people at home ask us, what about your pets? This brutally hot weather can be deadly for them as well. News 13's David Romero live at the city's dog park in the South Valley with this morning's You Ask, We Answer. Good morning, David. Seems like now would be the great time to take the dog out to the park. That's exactly right, Matt. These are the perfect hours of what they recommend. You should be walking the uh, the dog out now. Of course, the pavement's nice and cool. We'll get to that in a second. But there's no really good way of communicating with your animals. That's why they're going to rely on you to protect them from the heat of the day. Now, ideally, most owners would like to keep their pets indoors and sheltered. But for those who can't, here are some good tips. Uh, some of the obvious ones that we found were uh, for protecting the animals, rather, it comes from the folks at the Animal Humane New Mexico. This includes providing shaded areas available for the outside uh, dog or cat so they can seek shelter from the sun. And you also want to keep fresh water for your pets and lots of it. They're going to need it over the course of the day. And now you also never want to walk your dog during the peak temperature times of the day on the blacktop pavement. That's because it can be well over 100 degrees and burn their paws. Now, summer months not only bring hot temps, but dangerous mosquitoes as well. If a dog gets bitten by a mosquito, they can contract heartworm, and it can very oftentimes be a deadly disease. And it's incredibly hard to treat, but easy to prevent. You just give them a heartworm preventative. So take care of your heartworm for your dogs. And of course, much like a small child, you never ever want to leave an animal locked inside a vehicle, even if the windows are cracked. You know that those temperatures in there can soar in just a matter of minutes. Now, if you do see this, you are urged to call police immediately. This is considered animal cruelty. Matt, back to you. All right, thanks, David. Great tips for everyone this morning. To find out more, get to go to krqe.com. A little later this morning, we'll have a link set up to the Animal Humane's website with lots more tips for you there.